Hi, I'm Steve Maher, the ergonomics guy, and this is a workstation on wheels. It used to be called a computer on wheels, but the acronym is COW, and patients didn't like that. So it's now called a LOW, or a workstation on wheels. And what it is, it's a computer cart that allows you to move from room to room, and we're seeing this in a lot of healthcare situations where you can take this from one patient room to another. Um, and what's nice about it is it's very flexible. It gives you the ability to sit and stand. I'd just like to review some of the features with you and show you how to set it up to make it really effective for you. So first thing is, if you're gonna stand, what you wanna do is relax your shoulders, bend your elbows 90 degrees, and then you'll bring the entire cart up. There's a, a lever here that you lift, and the whole thing will come up. And so you're gonna bring this up so the keyboard is around elbow level, and you can fine tune that with the keyboard tray right here. There's a grip here in the back and the whole thing will come up or down. And so you're gonna position that so it's about elbow level. So your shoulders are comfortable, your forearm's about 90 degrees, your wrists are nice and straight, and the keyboard is right here. There is a knob here on the top that you probably can't see, but that allows us to change the angle of the keyboard. I don't know if you can see me in there. Uh, but you can change the angle of the keyboard and that's going to help you keep your wrist nice and straight. There's also a mouse platform here and what that does is it holds the mouse. Now the problem with that is that the mouse is lower than the keyboard so you're always reaching out and down. So if you have a cart like this with the mouse pull out, what you can do, pardon me, is grab a small book and put it right underneath your mouse. And what that does is it brings it up so the whole platform is the same level, and that way you're reaching over and, and not down, so you're not extending your, your wrist as much. You can also set the position of the key, the monitor here. There's a couple things. There's um, This is on an arm, so the whole thing will come down, and then there's this little bracket back here, come around here, and we can loosen this, and that allows us to change the tilt. So what we can do is adjust the height and tilt of the monitor, so when we're here typing, we can adjust that to a comfortable height and position. So we're not adapting to the height of the monitor, we're bringing it down. And what you wanna do is set that so that your eye level is about the top third of the screen. So for me, this is just a little low, I might bring that back up a little bit, okay? So that on straightaway, whoops. And I might bring this back up a little bit. Something like that. Oops. Make sure the tension is set, so if it's falling like that, it means that the, the tension in the arm isn't set correctly, and they can fix that so it will hold its position. Um, some other things that you can do, this is a scanning uh, sensor, and so what happens is you're typing here, you're working with a patient, um, and then you have to reach out here and scan a med and then go give it to them. What you might do is take this scanner and put the cord through here and put it there so that when you're reaching, you're not reaching up and out quite so much, or if possible, you might be able to hang it here or put it closer somehow or even Velcro it down so that you're, you're here instead of reaching out so much. Um, but if you have to, it's there. So. Um, and the other thing that's kind of cool about this is you can lower it down to sitting. And what you're going to do is lift this arm, push the whole thing down, and then it's like a standard workstation. Um, you're going to adjust the keyboard down to a comfortable height so when you're sitting, your shoulders are relaxed, your elbows are 90 degrees, and your wrists are straight. Again, you can use the little knob to change the angle to keep your wrist nice and straight. And then you'll adjust the monitor height in here, and you just push this down. And then if this was looser, we can easily adjust that too. But we can push this down so that when I'm sitting, I'm going to get a neutral position. And then I can easily move from sitting to standing throughout the day. So that is how to use a workstation on wheels. Um, it can be a very effective tool for working with patients. Thank you very much.